Thanks for staying with us this afternoon. The Rocky Mount Police Department is crediting cutting edge technology for decreasing gun violence in the city. CBS North Carolina's David Hurst gives us a preview of his special report. I would have never in a million years thought this would happen to my son. Tamika Horn's son, Nairi was playing basketball with friends at a nearby park when someone wearing a ski mask came up and shot him in the head. His life has completely changed. In the two years since the shooting, Nairik has shown incredible progress, but still struggles to speak and is partially paralyzed. Horn has seen firsthand the impact of gun violence and says the city is still dealing with that problem. It's just scary because you're out here and you never know when anybody's going to come up. They might come up on a car, they might walk up with a gun, want to shoot. You don't never know. It's one of the reasons why the Rocky Mount Police Department implemented a program called Shot Spotter. So we've seen very good results. That's tonight at 6 o'clock. CBS North Carolina's David Hurst has an in-depth look at Shot Spotter. So tune in as he looks at how it works and the difference police say that it's making.